Get ready, because you're about to be an ATL. -L -E One of the last posts on my website a year ago. Well, it was February 2021. This is 20. Yeah. So it's a little bit over a year ago. Was that Candy knew she was a side chick. Jazzabelle, you in here, Jazzabelle? You remember what the last post on my, my site was? Y'all be dragging me about not writing no more. Um, well, uh, Block has uh, <laughs> come forward and reiterated what I had already told y'all about this story. And now I didn't want to talk about that relationship when Candy block, brought Block on the show, when Candy, you know, was arguing with Block about child support. She tried to use that as her storyline. You know, Candy is my girl, man. I mean, that used to be my girl, too. <laughs> I can't. You know, I I talked about it. Candy had got mad at me. Candy called me on the phone and said he wasn't married. He was coming law married. And I was like, look, I look, the story is the story. I can't change history. Don't be mad at me, Candy. But what I had actually said was he was in a relationship with the wife and four kids at home. So for her not to understand why he's not there for her is 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 baffling to me. Right. But anyway, um, but yeah, so um, Block has gone on to Vlad TV, and he had a lot to say about um, Candy. And um, hold on, we gonna we gonna listen to a little bit. Ooh, common law equal not single Candy. Ooh, that's what that's that's what Block is said. Block was on Vlad TV, and it's a video called Block on the drama with Candy Burris after she got pregnant while he was married now black said it now that black said it can y'all is it true or is he lying too <laughs> let me know is he lying too i don't know but he said it while he was married see riley old older now so it's not like we talk about a kid but even though she in her 20s but uh, she is 20 i don't think she's in her 20s yeah damn good whatever, whatever you see, uh uh hey. Let me put my, my, my disclaimer, okay? Uh, shout out to Vlad TV. Y'all go and watch the full interview. Please go over there. Meanwhile, this uh, is fair use. This is for criticism, commenting, uh, news reporting, and all of that jazz. Here it is. Copyright disclaimer on the section 107, okay? It's uh, allowances made for fair use for purposes such as criticism, comment, news reporting, teaching scholarship, and research, okay? While y'all here, y'all just get in here. Go ahead and click that like button, okay? Yeah. Okay, I'm not saying anything that people might not know because you made uh, an appearance on Real Housewives oh, yeah. of yeah. Atlanta, oh, no, no, no. too. Yeah. Why didn't that relationship work out, Block? Honestly, I, I, like when I sit back, it was it wasn't gonna work for a couple of a couple of reasons. Uh -oh. And um, the first being you was married. And I think one of the reasons is, you know, I'm all the way street, and um, you know, we gonna do what we do. I know a lot of people that get on my ass about, you know, she was a side chick and she was a side chick. So, you know, whenever you do, like, whenever you deal with another girl that's side, you know, for, well, first of all, I had two daughters, I mean, two daughters when I started dealing with Candy. Oh, now he dropping names. He had two daughters when he started dealing with Candy. You know, a situation. And, um, and I think, just looking back, just trying to say positive about it, I just think, you know, um, sometimes people think from their past relationship that because they helped this person or did this for this person, and I didn't need none of that. You know what mm -hmm. I'm saying? I didn't need no type of help, no type of assistance like said, from he no didn't female need no help. when it like came to time. my career. So I think some people thought, oh, can't put a block on, but I, no, nah, that won't happen. <laughs> Wait a minute. <laughs> That sounds like Shade the Todd. I'm sorry. He said <laughs> people think he needed help in his career. He didn't need no help in his career. People think that she was. <laughs> I got to hear that again. I'm sorry. I didn't need no type of help, no type of assistance from no female when it came to my career. Ooh. So I think some people thought, oh, can't put a block on. But I don't... No, that won't happen. Um, but yeah, but just going back, I just stay just dealing with her through some sideline shit. It wasn't gonna never work like that because it was solid. Mm. The foundation wasn't built like that. You know what I'm saying? Like I already had a family going into that situation, and then I'm bringing in another daughter in this situation, and I was gonna leave home, and that's where the mm -hmm. terminus came in. 
So when I got you. So okay. so so when I wasn't gonna go home, I'm not showing the video for a reason. Okay, I'm sure I'm I'm letting y'all see the audio. Okay, I'm letting y'all 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 can hear it, right? Can y'all hear it? Okay, we're gonna talk about what he said, not how he. Then looked. it was like, you know, then she handled her business by calling my house and doing that, and that ain't gonna happen. I can't be around that sister, that type of shit. Let Ooh. me tell my situation. You know, just not like going to like so much of the detail. But yeah, but that people. just wasn't gonna work once the once the daughter came into the play. You know, she just felt like, well, let me call her and tell her what's going on. We're going all the time. Okay, so let me just let me just ask you this and just being fair to the situation. Okay. <laughs> this is so ghetto. <laughs> this is so ghetto. <laughs> this <is> married man <laughs> Look, and I'm defending Candy now too, right? This is a married man to say. <laughs> you decide shit. You know, I don't care if you got a baby. It's up to me to tell my wife. <laughs> I'm sorry. This is funny. But uh we, we pick these men, okay? We we pick these men. I'm just saying <laughs> I'm blaming Candy for this. Oh, this is juicy. And then he got a t-shirt that say fell in love with a real nigga. <laughs> the jokes write themselves, Lord. Oh yeah. Did 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 Candy know that you had a family at home? Absolutely. Or did you at that time being a young man do what a lot of young men do yeah. and have somebody on the side without telling them you I, I got a whole situation that I'm in? Now, I mean, she knew to you know what she knew about the whole family, but she probably, hey, I'm candy bird and shit here. I'm gonna take this. <laughs> oh, better be strong. I'm gonna snatch this one. <laughs> 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 so it's like, hey, you know, now that shit go. Now you are right. I mean, some people say that, but is she know that you tell her, man? This is so ghetto. At the time, I was a grown ass man. You know what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. I had my first daughter when I was 16 years old, man. You know what I'm saying? And uh, and, and, and honestly, man, at that time, women didn't give a damn about what you had. They going for them. Like me, if I pull up on your chick, I'm going damn about you if I don't know you. Mm -hmm, I'm going to mm -hmm. shoot mine. You know? Yep. <laughs> what the hell is happening, y'all? What is happening? <laughs> All right. How, you know, obviously... It'd be a complicated situation for anybody. Yeah. You have a child outside of your relationship, your wife pissed off. Now you have uh, a woman on the side, a baby mother on the side. What's your relationship like with your daughter? We cool. We're coming along. Now, I'm going to keep it real with you. Before I got on that show, we, we, we was cool. I don't know what happened between 10, 11, to 14 to 15. You know, like I had daughters. I mean, I, mean, you know, I got two daughters prior to this, you know. And I'm thinking sometimes your daughters, they go through whatever they go through when they get a certain age. So mm -hmm. I'm just looking at it like, okay, she's just going through her growing spurt with she ain't dad, little baby no more. Yeah, she, you know, she you know, smell herself. So I'm thinking that part. But I think a lot of people get in her head, you know, as in, because um, a lot of jealousy because all my kids live with me. I got three daughters and three boys. Every last one of them live with me except Rod. Oh. Wow. Okay. Live with me from they born to they graduated. Except Candy. I think and I got companies named after them, a lot of stuff. And I think it's a lot of jealousy because Riley was in that situation because her mom put me on child support. Now, how you got more money than me? They mom. And you put me on child support. Block, you sound nuts. Lord. You you her father regardless, bro. I don't bro, care how much money bro, she got. Bro, I never, ever, ever. Now, I, I raised kids that wasn't mine. And she knew this. That was her attraction. Mm -hmm. That was one of her attractions to me. You know what I'm saying? I raised kids that wasn't mine. Why wouldn't I raise mine? Now, once you start putting my business in the street, now mm -hmm. it's... See, it's really hectic, and, and we keep it really kind of, you know, the situation as in. for talking. I don't need nobody to tell me to raise mine, and I never have. Mm -hmm. 
And I paid mm-hmm. all the way. Now, when she got 14, she was like, yo, listen, you, you, and, you and Riley got your own situation. Take care of the business. I didn't keep service seats. I didn't do the right thing with that. And I take that. And it cost me. Like, I'm not take care of mine. Now, you don't call my baby mama when you're not eight months. And you tell the girl at home with me, you pregnant, this, that, that. It's Maggie. Hold on the ad camera, y'all. Lord, this is so ghetto. Even Biggie saying it's ghetto. Biggie, hush. Oh, Lord. Hold on, it's back. Hold on. Now, you and her, both of them argue. She tell her, keep that baby over there. They argue. Now, Cannon Cannon says she ain't gonna never let her baby come to my house because of the shit they argued about. Now, I'm in a trick bag. Now, I'm out here, me me and I'm on mama's house, and I gotta go home with this shit. You know what I'm saying? So it's kind of like, listen, you know, I'm gonna plant the right foot. I'm gonna do the right thing, but you can't keep keep stirring up shit because I want her to be like, come and meet her brothers and sisters, which happened. Mm -hmm. Because one of my daughters Mm -hmm. stayed with Candy for a while. Like, all of us real cool. See, a lot of people don't know. You know what I'm saying? Like, one of my daughters it's stayed with Candace for, for a year or two. That's why I said mm. It's a lot. So, right now, it's safe to say y'all in a good place. Riley got to be about... How old is Riley now? She got to be about 18 20. or so She's 20. She, I mean, she'll be 20, 20. coming up. Child support good. paid on. All that shit. We good. Oh, oh shit, y'all. Oh, hold on, hold on, hold on, hold on. Child support <laughs> paid off? Ha <laughs> <laughs> ha! Hey, oh, hold on, full, yo, yo, let's that double shit. back on that right there. <laughs> Say it again. <laughs> Yeah, <laughs> that needs to be said, bro. bro that child support. Bro, that that gizzle, nigga. Shit. We <laughs> <laughs> oh man. Nah, you a funny dude, but I'm glad it worked <laughs> out. I'm glad that I'm glad the Marin, yo, because that child support. Boom. That's like having it. Woo! Second. What, 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 you, what happened, you know, bro? I don't like on nobody anyway, so that wasn't gonna be hovering over my head. You know, it was just uh-huh. the fact that I just felt like I got put in a trick bag with it because I'm still doing what I'm supposed to do, but you screaming I'm not. But, you know, and then you try kind of, she kind of never kept me away from her, but she never made it either. She never said, no, nah, this show we can go to your dad's house or this, that. And I didn't really pursue that because of the situation I was in. So I just took what she gave me and it made me look like it did. Now, I understand. And, and, and even looking from, you know, the child's standpoint and, you know. That's the key, though, bro. It, it, it should have been about her. You know what I'm uh-huh. saying? It should have been about let's raise this child the right way. You know Absolutely. what I'm saying? Yeah, because clearly if, you know, you got you got four other children that have I'm been with you. I didn't, I didn't birth. Yeah. You, you, you are not a deadbeat dad. Oh, and far I, and from I give you that. So. Yeah, it should always be about the kid. Okay. He he has four or five more interviews over there talking about what he used to do and talking about uh his uh career and all of all of that. So if y'all wanna go watch it, go watch it over on Vlad TV. Now um listen, listen, listen. A hot ghetto mess. A hot ghetto mess. He said you on candy side somewhat. Somewhat. I mean, he said candy kept Riley away, but then he said he didn't try to listen. Ooh. Meanwhile, Candy and Riley have both responded to Russell Block Spencer. And it seems they're both over it. Riley hit up the shade room comments where she stated, My mom and I always try to take the high road. But honestly, it's really upsetting that I constantly have to see you bad-mouthing us publicly. I was blessed to be raised in a household where my mom provided the best life I could have. No jealousy here. I would appreciate it if you could stop talking about us. 
Candy posted this to her Instagram stories where she says, I don't care how well I'm doing. I still need that money you owe me. Don't block your blessing. Not doing right by your children. I can't talk about uh, that. That I cannot. Anyway, block is trash. But what does that make Candy for picking him up to be her? But picking him to be her child's father. I'm looking at everybody sideways right now. I really am. I really am. He was with Portia too. Lord, he block got around. Huh? Block got around. Hit that like button if you want to enjoy the stream. Now, um, that's all I got. Uh, I'm I'm stunned. I am stunned. I mean, my story was a little bit better than that. I would just rather block and just stay silent. Okay. I would have rather block it, just stay silent. At least I told, like, it was just clear cut and whatever. But there's that. It is what it is. Okay. Like is like. Okay. Look, they say water, water seeks its own level. That's what they say. But I'm digressing. Candy and Block would be together today if it wasn't for that damn wife. If it wasn't for that damn wife getting in the way of Candy and her happiness. But I'm digressing. Moving on, moving on.